Good day, Sacramento. I'm Hilisa Ortiz hanging out this morning inside the theater. I love just saying it like that. <laughs> B Street at the Sophia. It is such a beautiful place to come check out some incredible, incredible acting and theater productions. They do so many great shows here. And there is one that is happening right now. It is called Lovers and Executioners. And this is where it takes place. And I have two of the fantastic actors with me this morning. Meher. Yes, did I say that? And yes. Peter, good morning to you. Good morning. Good morning. All right, so tell us a little bit who you play. So I play Constance okay. um, in the show, The Town Maiden. She's on the prowl for a suto. Ooh. One of them is. And I play a conquistador from Spain named Don Lope, who's come to win her affection. <laughs> <laughs> I, I can't even look at you guys with a straight face. I love it. Tell me a little bit about the show. What well, it's a very old play, but it's been a new adaptation. Okay. It's written in verse, so we rhyme everything, which is really fun for the audience. And it's about a man who suspects his wife of being unfaithful, mm -hmm. so he banishes her to a desert island. Yeah. She gets rescued and comes back disguises as a man oh. to re exact her revenge on her husband. It's very funny. It's kind of like Three Musketeers meets the Three Stooges. <laughs> that is fantastic. That is fantastic. Um, you said, so everything rhymes. Is that easier or harder when it comes to memorizing those lines? Um, it, I, I would say, in terms of memorizing, it was just as it's harder when you're on stage and you go up on a line ah. and then coming up with a rhyme to make it. You have to rhyme, rhyme to fix it. You got to mm -hmm. rhyme. To fix He's it. good at that. Can you give us a little something, something? Of the of the rhyme, yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, Bernard charged with murder, of course. Don't you see? Frederick has acted. He's done it for me. His rival from my hands now utterly defeated. By law, not by sword. I say he cheated. That uh, accent is quite fantastic. I have a little Spanish accent, yes, because I'm from España. <laughs> that is fantastic. All right, the show is underway, and it's still going. You've got about seven shows to go. We have seven shows left. This is our final week, Tuesday yeah. through Sunday. Show every day, two on Wednesday. Oh, my gosh. All right, let's take them behind the scenes. Can we real quick? I'll take you back here, you guys. It's so cool. I love this because it's such an intimate setting, right? And you, normally you don't get to see behind the, sta behind the stage, behind the scenes, but we get to do that. I see... Oh, is yep, there, this is our prop uh, practice, oh, where we receive all of our props if we need our gold ducats to pay off. You never know when you need that. <laughs> uh -huh. And lots of sword fighting in this show. So oh. if you like swashbuckling and sword fighting, this is the show. Is that you. why you signed up for this show? I did. <laughs> I sadly do not get to sword oh, fight. No, no. <laughs> no, she does steal my sword at one do. point, though. It's, a, it's an issue of I contention. Do. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Let's thank you. Continue. You'll notice he was just telling me they've got carpet here, right? Because you guys have to go behind the scene and you don't want people to hear you out in the audience. So this is how we keep it quiet over here. You've got some costumes and some wigs. Now, Peter, do you wear a wig? I am very lucky I do not have a wig. Instead, they said we're going to dye you platinum blonde for the whole oh, show. So this is not my normal was, hair color, facial color. I ask you. That is not your, it's totally your color, though. Oh, well, thank you. Thank you. Maybe I should keep it. <laughs> I love it. Let's talk about some of these costumes. Very period time, right? Mm-hmm. Yes. It's a classic look. We're in France yeah. 300 years ago, but it is a very relatable play that the audiences just have been dying. It's oh, been great. Oh, my gosh. It must be so fun for you guys to be back in person. Oh, hundred yeah. percent. It's just it, every day. It just yeah. feels feel very blessed and very lucky, and it's just it's great to be back on stage. Oh yeah. my gosh! Well, I'm so excited to be back. I'm so excited for all of you as well. All right, we can come back this way, but just be forewarned, you, there might be something a little eerie. Don't be too scared. Don't be too scared. Fencing dummy. Oh, <laughs> the fencing dummy. Oh, poor guy. We've seen some hard treatment over the course what? of the show. Wow. <laughs> Just a little bit. Yeah, All right, no, my no, friends. No. Poking at you, poking at you. Oh, oh, whoops. Oh, oh, wow. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, my goodness. All right, it is called Lovers and Executioners. <laughs> Pulled his arm off. Yeah. Oh my goodness. You never know what's going to happen behind the scenes. All right. All the information, if you would like to catch a show, it, it runs through Sunday. Check them out. Support your local theater. Yeah. The theater. Okay. I just have to say it like that. <laughs> Thanks, too. Oh my gosh. Liz and Libs and whatnot. Well, get yourself a whole new look with timeless pieces and fresh fit.